Hey everybody, Anicus here, and welcome back to another episode of Moon Quest. Yay! Uh, we're back on the moon. We're not on Mars today. Um, for, for good reason. We, we had a little incident. And also, the life support is still out here, and hopefully I can remedy that today. The incident is... I don't know what happened over here. But uh, mobs were just dropping in here like crazy. And I was fighting them off at the door. And a creeper blew up right there. Inside the chamber. And, well, the rest is just all over the place in little bits. The other thing you'll notice is that I'm using my old sword. Um, and that is because that singularity machine that I built accidentally right-clicked on the, uh, the bin with my sword. And <laughs> it ate it. <laughs> so it's gone. I don't know how much that actually added matter-wise, but it's gone. Anyway, I ripped the tree down. I plan to redo the life support system. Um, the leaf block thing is just not working. There's quite a bit of stuff we have to do for this, but we will try to get that done today. So, today's all about moon diamonds. Uh, but, because it takes me time to do stuff and talk about stuff, before we get on that, let's try to fix this up a little bit. That's just regular glass. These will not connect. That's okay. Um, moon diamonds. Yeah, I have a problem. My quarry's almost done. Uh, and I still have pretty much no diamonds. In fact, this pack adds enough ores to your world that diamonds become extremely difficult to collect and obtain. Uh, which is kind of funny. So I don't actually have any tin blocks. There might be some in the basement here. Let's go check. So... Getting diamonds is really difficult, and everything I need to do kind of here going forward is waiting for diamonds, which is funny, right? Uh, you'd think with quarries, you'd be swimming in diamonds, but I'm not. So, <clears throat> I've, I've realized something about the moon base, other than the fact that I've blown it to smithereens. Uh, let's see here. Put one there this uh, actually no players within one meter oh dear invert okay it's probably because it's broken I think that's why it's freaking out oh do I have enough oh I'm short no oh well, we could make it smaller I uh, will make it smaller and we can take that out and this <laughs> we gotta do what we gotta do. Uh, I need this back together. <clears throat> yeah, anyway, I realized that the moon is probably the only place I have left that has a nuclear reactor. A functioning nuclear reactor. Is that gonna work? Player is within one meter. Uh, hmm. Maybe not. I don't need those corner bits, do I? Nope, I do not. I'm sure one airlock block for reals. <sighs> I gotta go back. <laughs> we can make more. It's fine. I don't know why that didn't work. It should, but... All my other ones are three blocks wide. Maybe that's the minimum. Oop, going the wrong way. Go to Mars. Everything is good on Mars. Go to Ascorp. It's actually still in the table, too. Um, yeah, anyway. So, I actually realized we have a nuclear reactor there, and because of that, we can make diamonds, because we have pretty much unlimited power. A uh, hell of a lot more power than here. No, that's the mining world. And that's going to be way better than depending on these huge 64 by 64 quarries that I've been building. There we go. My game volume is really loud. Okay. Oh, now it's working. What? Is this some kind of joke? Okay, no. <laughs> okay, well, yeah, it's... Huh. Glitchy. What? This mod's not glitchy. Shush. 
Uh, I am missing a lot of iron, so I can't make this too fancy. But I can put in some temporary blocks, like so. And <laughs> this is just going to have to be how it's going to be. Uh, let's take a look on the outside. Eh, it doesn't look too badly messed up. Maybe a bit. Oh, okay. We can, we can change these out. There we go. Piece of cake. It looks beautiful. Actually, we might as well switch these for Tinker's Blocks, too. I don't think I ever had this sealed for air. I don't think that was affected. I don't know how the mobs were dropping in here. Uh, it seemed to be lit up okay, but they definitely got in. I know one of my cannons is out. Uh, I probably could replace that. I have a spare. But they were here and in force. Okay, so let's hit F7. Uh, that didn't seem to do anything. There's no light in here. There's no torches. So let's put some torches down. And in here. And hopefully that'll be good. And I won't have to deal with the mobs again. Today. Or anytime soon. <laughs> this looks awful. This symmetry is just killing me. <laughs> okay. Anyway, uh, moon diamonds. Yeah. So the power is still running, and it's a bit slow. I could upgrade the wiring, but it's still running. So we got ourselves a heat press here, and I actually brought the ore form over here. And you can see there's actually one in progress. Uh, just the power is a little underwhelmed. It takes a long time to make a diamond. Um, so, oop, can't do that. Okay. So I think what we'll try to do today is we will try to upgrade the wiring. So there's different kinds of uh, universal cable. Actually, before I do that, let's see here. This here is being fed into this room. Is that another heat press? Oh, it's a tool charger. Really? It looks the same as the heat press. It really does. Tier 3, maybe? Tier 1. Okay, yeah, that's got two plates. That's solid. Okay, so anyway, how is the power fed into this room? I guess the only way to find that out... And yeah, I'm going to run out of air. I mean, that's, that's a given. That's an issue. I don't have anything made to actually bring the O2 back online. One thing at a time. Okay, so we have conduit going back here. Oh, okay. It looks like we've got a little energy module in the wall. So that's kind of low power. Um, and that's that was to keep the room sealed. So I think what we could do is probably put in hmm, an energy cube maybe somehow. Uh, or will that break the seal? It'd be nice to have that thing on its own energy cube. Now, I don't think it will plug the wall, though. That'll be a problem. So, maybe we can have a separate room just for making diamonds. Uh, we got the space. Maybe we could do it over here. This is a giant, giant space that we're not using for anything. Maybe we can just tap off this wire. Actually... Yeah, I mean, if I if I wire right into this, uh, I could just probably add some higher tier cable and kind of take a piece of this room. Or maybe this whole room could just be the diamond man manufacturing plant. Let's do that. Okay, good plan. I'm glad you guys suggested that. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a little prep work. Uh, unless you guys want to watch me dig a ton of blocks on camera. I don't think you do. And we will get that set up. And maybe in that time, we'll see how many diamonds we make. Okay, a couple of additions um, for the moon. Got a new laser gun. I had to do some upgrades here back at Ascorp. Um, made some elite universal cable. I would have made the higher end stuff, but I guess I should just type in universal. The ultimate requires these atomic cores, which require diamonds <laughs> so which is the whole problem so maybe when we get uh enough diamonds as a surplus we could actually i should make a book directly from ascorp to 
to the moon. That'd be handy. Still not night. That's good. Let's go put this laser cannon in first. Um, it should work. I think the wiring is okay on it. Still no life support. I had to go fill up my oxygen tanks. Okay. So, that should be good. Uh, we'll see. That might be too close. Like, they can't hit anything up here. And I think maybe that's... I don't know. Maybe that's where the mobs spawned. But I don't know how they got into the base. I'm, like, not sure how they dropped in. So... We'll see. Uh, it's midday, so we get probably another four mine, three or four Minecraft days before everything goes bad. This place needs a lot of work now that I've <laughs> had to look at it. I almost got the room done. I ran out of iron. I don't care. I'm, oh, torch popped off the wall. I, I will get to that one day. Uh, the other thing is, is that we still need kind of like an access panel. I don't really have anything to make it out of. So, I guess this is going to be the access panel, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> it isn't pretty, I get that. Maybe I'll make the access panel... Ugh, damn hole. We should just plug this for now. I don't have the stuff to make another door. Or I didn't make the other door, I should say. I, I probably have it. I just didn't make it. That looks pretty bad, too, actually. We didn't do that on the other side, so why do it on this side? And I probably threw all my tin in the AE system back in Ascorp. Is there any more tin blocks here? Moon construction. Moon-based construction. Who would have thought? This is all about the diamonds. I think we have some fancy stuff down here. Yeah, I don't really want to use that. The tin decoration blocks. Oh man. Talk about... Mm. Alright, well, we'll just fill it. There we go. Problem solved. Okay, so... Uh, I think what we'll do is we'll punch a hole in the center. Well, I guess I should see how far this Elite Cable goes. So the Elite Cable is 8 kilojoules. The, um, the high-end stuff is 32, which would have been preferable. This is one of those, what is, what kind of cube is this? Ultimate, so this has got quite a bit of energy. Mind you, I'm not really sure how quickly the reactor can recharge this. I've never tested it. Uh, will these guys connect together? I guess that's the next question. Because if I do this, I might lose power to all my systems. Well, let's find out. I bet you I do. I bet you I have to make another cube. Let's Oh, no, it connects. Okay, sweet. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We are going to pop it out here. And we'll put in a couple. Um, actually, we'll do one more. I am so glad this stuff connects together. It's pretty. Uh, we may not be able to go around here. We'll have to see. I might have to yank some of this. Oops. I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, seven, eight. We'll see. Would be nice if it was in the center of the wall, but... There we go. Good enough. For now. When I can make more, I'll move it slightly. Yeah, wow, that's just that's just something. Well, we've got one tin decorative block now. <laughs> okay, so I guess what we're gonna do is we're gonna go take that heat press or not heat press, yeah, heat press off the wall. Oh, it's in the middle of doing a diamond. This is how slow it is. Seriously, we're gonna lose some charcoal if we interrupt the process. Screw it. We're going to interrupt it. Um, maybe it'll retain its state. I don't know. Probably not. Oh! Broke the window. Oxygen escaping. No, we're fine. Okay, so ore form. Heat press. No stored energy, so it's reset. 
And we'll stick it right in the wall, in the hole. Now if this works, I have a ton of charcoal. Like if this is a reasonable, or not charcoal, reasonable, reasonable speed, I've got tons of... How you do? How you do? Not so good. <laughs> really? It's connected. So uh, the line here was out, these two blocks. So I rotated the, uh, the energy cube and energy filled the line and this thing filled up with power so now i'm out of char we're out of coal so i have to go get some <laughs> so i think that might have fixed it i think that's all that was required just glitchiness with some of these mods um they don't like anything changing you know hopefully this is it should be four times as fast i think that's what a basic cube is or a basic um wire no not ultimate Universal cable. Oh, it's 500, so this should be 16 times as fast. Let's find out. Ah. You going? You not going. You're not doing nothing. Hmm. I don't get it. Seriously. <laughs> Maybe I need to put a cube on the back of that thing. This is fun. A little bit of experimentation here. Total charge 5,800 out of 6,000. There's no sides with this thing. It's just... Oh, it's going. Okay. So it's still slow, but the energy is able to fill back up Oh, it's not that slow. It's and it's recharging as as at least as quickly as it can use the energy. It's still pretty slow. Any moment now. Oh, almost there. So close. Just on the edge of making a diamond. It's gonna happen any second. Not a fast process, but it does make diamonds. And I do have a lot of coal. And I have the power. Uh, I'm not entirely 100% sure about the power situation. I think the reactor might not be running on the infinite energy glitch. There we go. We have a diamond. So let actually, before I stick more in here, the hitbox. Yeah, okay, that, that's a weird. There we go. Um, yeah, let's see. Is this thing charging? It looks like it's charging. It looks like it's getting energy. Oh, wow. Nope. Look at the drain. So the infinite energy glitch from the reactors seems to be a thing of the past with this version of a galactic craft which is okay the only thing is I'm gonna take some radiation poisoning here because <laughs> I believe the uranium is out of here uh, I could start it up though we didn't use that much oh yeah okay you know what I'll go put my suit on I will go put I gotta fix this all up this is a disaster if we're gonna do this if we're gonna make diamonds here still dropping uh, the laser guns are on the I put two furnaces on in here to cook some potatoes that are not working so we have an energy sink I don't know what it is um, something's just drawing energy which that's that's great <laughs> I've got some some kind of issue oh uh, yeah no I have no idea what it would be uh, okay, well, let's go put on the uh, the hazmat suit. Uh, let's pop that in our... Oop. Get the energy back up. Um, and then I'll, uh, I'll put the uranium back in. We can get the power going again. So, well, you know what? I'm not actually disappointed that the... Uh, oh, no. Okay, it's just this. It's making another thing. Okay, let's let's stop it just temporarily for a sec. And let's just see, is the energy glitch fixed or not? If it's not fixed, this will be recharging. Ah, oh, poop. Recharging right now. Uh, put that there. Okay, so there's still an energy glitch, which is good. But you can see it's not enough to uh, recharge 
while you're doing this. This takes a lot of power. Still, I'm going to put the uranium in anyway. We'll have to see. Uh, but diamonds, baby. Diamonds. <laughs> I think it's awesome. Um... Because this is not something we could do on Earth. <laughs> the amount of energy... Well, I mean, I could build a bunch of nuclear reactors. Uh, and a bunch of heat presses. And blow Ascorp 2.0 uh, right off the face of the map. That would be awesome. Anyway, diamonds, guys! Diamonds! Woohoo! Whoop. There we go. <laughs> There's hope. See you guys next time. Bye, everybody.